Yo, what's up guys? Samahan niyo po ako at pupunta po tayo kay Michael Prime. Siya po ang isa po naming club member at i-check po natin ang mga ibo niya at ang kanyang lock. Samahan niyo po ako. Yeah, we love birds. <laughs> So all hands? Yeah, these are the hands. Yeah, can't, can't stop them. <laughs> I keep putting birds in here, that's the trouble. Yeah. What's it closer? Yeah. First year in stock, he bred a couple of soft birds on the north from St. Lawrence. His yeah. grandson won the Union National um, on the north, and his great grandson landed with him. He's, he's been really good for me, but if you want to use him, you can use him. Yeah, okay, yeah. Uh, the other red cocks next to him. What's all of that? looks nice. He's, he's flown 600 miles four times. He's just a bit so old Brisbane bar, Bell Bar, Brigo. He's he bred um, Danny Perkins. He had two birds on the second day from first fed from Winton. Yeah. He bred one of them. How about that blue bird there? It looks like, this blue bird? Yeah. Oh, he's bred for stock. I tossed him out. His, um, his dad was one of Kandra Clockbird years ago, and he's bred first fed home hill, first combine in a minka. Um, I paired him to his granddaughter, which was first fed Windora, and that's the only squeaker I got. So, yeah. But, yeah, anything. Few double rung ones. The last last week, as I got out of my Cooper's Creek fed winner before she died. Yeah. The double okay. yellows. But yeah, there's, that's the second fed Winton. That's his full brother. Was third, third from the Cumbra. Yeah. All over shots. They got all distance bird, eh? Pretty well. There's there's not many. Not many that are sprint middle. Yeah, I enjoyed the long dist the distance race there. Yeah, then, was, uh, yeah, pretty much all I agreed for. Oh my dear, the Dark Checker is a new addition. Graham McKay <coughs> got second fed from Home Hill with him. So I paired him with my first fed Home Hill. Yeah. And this year with my second combine, Nakandra. Yeah, what is he? Uh, I think he's Evans Balf. Don Collins bred him. Oh, okay. He's a Breeders' Plate yeah, speaker with yeah. healing. And he, he placed in the Breeders' Plate race. Yeah. And the next year he was, he was second fed home. Yeah, yeah I got a couple of um, Evans in there, but yeah. they're all hands. They're yeah. from Don Collins? Yeah. yeah. So he, I don't know if he's straight SM Evans or whether he's Evans Balf. But yeah, the dark checker, he's definitely got Evans in him. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I got all that SM Evans from Don, and he yep. said he got, he got to put that one to the what's that, a million race in, oh, yeah, um, but he African didn't, yeah, African million yeah. race, but he didn't end up doing it. Yeah. Well, ne never had, never clocked most of them yet. But. <laughs> yeah, well, this this is really his first year. This yeah. week is in the race block, and they're all still there. Yeah. I think that's five out of five still there, so, yeah. That's old mate. That's the father of that blue bay he yeah. before. Yeah, look like that. So he, he got me 10th fed in um, And yeah, he's bred. Yeah. A heap of fed positions, fed winners, combine winners. Um, yeah, he's. 
So his uncle was my previous number one stock cock and he sort of taken it over. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. Um, and his nephew is sort of more up and coming best stock cock as well. So it's, yeah, it's just that old blood line. That, Mainly valve, but there's yeah. bits and pieces of everything in there. So, yeah, yeah, I think I'm doing good now on um, old lines. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't see all my gabbies. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> there's, there's a few good gabbies. Like, um, I had one good cock in particular, and his blood is through quite a few birds. Like, he's the grandfather of this fella. Yeah. <laughs> but not. He was a good race bird, he's a good stock cock, but I haven't had many gabbies that are actually Clocked. really good. Yeah. But that, that one fella, 230, he was, he was the pig. I think first time I clocked gabby, that's in Dalby. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it. I clocked one on the weekend that was half gabby, and it was actually a stray. Yeah. Danny down the hill. We started tossing together from the start, and she just came here, and she won't go back. And he, he took her home and let her go one night, and she came back here in the dark. Yeah, so okay. So like, oh, race her. Yeah. And I clocked her on the weekend. Yeah, okay. But yeah, yeah. that's that same bloodline. So, so what's in here? More stock cocks. More stocks. Yeah, bits and pieces. Where you pin them? Oh, Dump hill. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a bit wild. Not, I'm still not set up probably. I've, I've been here two years and I still haven't set everything up probably. But yeah, that old oh, red mate in the corner is that Ites and Gujar. I bought him from South Australia and he's bred quite a few clock birds. Um, second combine from the Kundra a couple of years ago was one of his. Yeah. Okay. And yeah. Up playing Winton and Morney and wherever else, so yeah, he's half handy. What do you think, Guja? Eitzen Guja. So Eitzen is a is similar to Guja, an old South Australian breed. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, just bits and pieces again. It's everything. He's the youngest, the younger car or he. Uh, this, some of them uh, looks young. Yeah, <laughs> old mate with the backwards legs, probably the youngest one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I couldn't race him, so I just threw him in here. Yeah, and yeah. He, he hit the power line. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyway, no, nah, dude. Just bits and pieces. A lot of birds bred for stock. Um, down off. My number one cop who stopped filling a few years ago, and they've, they've been pretty good. So, um, yeah. so I'll make there is that's 230, that Gabby cop that he's, um, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Got a few fed positions, and I don't know, I clocked him half a dozen times. Yeah. But he's as mad as a cut cat. What? What is he? Oh, Gabby. That's oh, Gabby. the one that dad bred for me to race. Yes. Yeah. And he's. Like his blood is through quite a few of these birds, but yeah, but it, he's got some good gabbies, but yeah, they just don't seem to fly well for me. I yeah, guess yeah. So he tosses them a lot more. Just probably. Yeah, that's why I'm good. I toss about twice a day, uh, twice a week now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah I can't do a lot play anymore. He's, yeah. The neighbors yeah. start yelling. <laughs> Jolly neighbors. Yeah. Oh. I, don't, I won't blame him, but yeah. he's get he's old fella, so yeah. I don't want to complain. Otherwise, yeah, yeah. get into a fight and still my post. Yeah. Mm. Just bits and pieces. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get this red yeah, okay. That's nice. The meat the gristles. Mm. What's that gristle there? That is a Jostone Jansen cross. Oh, yeah, I didn't do any good in Josh, Josh Stones. It's I only bred a couple out of her this year, and yeah, yeah one's going real well for Gab. Bits and pieces. What's your Tassie? Tassie's the next door. Okay. You'll see them, the brown ones. Oh, yeah, the pretty ones. Yeah. 
It looks big. Yeah. Chocolate. Yeah. So these, these real white ones started off real dark. Yeah. And then every time they melt, they get whiter. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, just like the tiger grizzle. Yeah. They're black when they're born and then yeah, they change color after they're more. Yeah. They get more white or more black. Yeah. Yeah. That gay pride hen up there, she's the second combo in the Kandra. And this black checker hen to your left is her full sister. She flew Winton and Minaminka. Yeah. And what are they? They're by that red cock. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. They're real good. Do you believe in eye sign? No. Yeah, no, same. As long as they got two. Two wings. Two wings, two eyes. <laughs> yeah. They don't have to have two legs in the middle. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I heard, I heard one story uh, when Johnny and it's he clock a bird only one, have one leg. Yeah. yeah. I don't have the fly, but the fly. <laughs> What's that one? That's, that's like a tassie as well. Tassie, okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's nice. It's pieces. This blue bar hen was my second bird home from Cloncurry, the 840 miles. That's my first one. Cloncurry? Yeah. That's. And that slate hen mum. There's a slate hen in here. She was my first bird home from Concarry. Oh, the, um, that's the mother of her. Um, yeah. What's the breeding of that one? That one, she's Jay Jansen. Jansen. She was. She got placed in the Gimpy 10,000 off the north. Yeah. And I paired her to a John Blockland cock bird to breed that um, Concarry hen. So how far is Ken Curry? Oh, about 840 800. miles, so you know, 13, 1400 k's. Yeah. yeah. Mm. How'd you go on, um, on Widow? We do one look. So, what's up guys? Nakauwi na po tayo galing kay Michael Prime. Hindi ko na po pinakita lahat ng procedure kasi nalobat ako. <laughs> so, check po natin yung mga nakuha kong ibon kay Michael. Lahi po neto is Tassie Sprinter. Sorry po, medyo maaraw ngayon. So, ito naman po is Gabby Bandenabil. Gabby po ito. Sprinter. O Speedbird. Ito po yung mga galing po kay Michael ito. Michael Prime. So, ito naman po is a long distance bird. So, nakalimutan ko po ang lahi na ito, pero katanong ko siya, tapos isulat ko na lang po sa baba. Long distance bird po ito. Ito po, long distance lines ulit Goodyear din po ito 
So ito naman po i ito naman po is Guja o Gujer. Another long distance line na naman po to. Australian long distance line po ang Gujer. So maganda po siya tignan. Mas maganda rin po siya mag-perform. Kaya mahilig po ako sa Gujer. Ito siya Gujer. So, ito po yung isa. Uh, pangalawa po to Yung isa po, yung kapatid. Magkamukhang ka magkamukha po. Pero mas maraming white yung isa. Mas maraming pong white sa sa ulo. Ito po. Mas konti, mas marami po yung red na ito. Tasi sprinter po to Tasi sprinter. Ha? 